ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? I'm ready. We've stopped and got gas and we are headed for our first stop we're headed to, to Greenville, South Carolina. We're going to eat a place called um, Swamp Rabbit Cafe. It's a place that Tony found that he's been like following what, about a year now. Probably yeah on Instagram. Yeah and they have, they're, they're very local farm to table. Everything's you know locally grown and, and processed there or whatever. I guess processed is not the right word but anyhow we decided we've never been to Greenville that we're gonna to go to a campground down there and spend a couple days and check out the, that cafe and then we're gonna head up to Pigeon Forge back to the same campground we were at before and spend two days but we want to check out there's a Cuban restaurant there we want to check out and um, it's actually on our way to Lexington because Tony has a gig in Lexington on Saturday so it kind of just worked out that from Greenville to Lexington Pigeon Forge was kind of a good place to stop in the middle and we are I think about three hours from our destination and I'm cutting cheese in the front seat. <laughs> Don't do this at home. But we were hungry. We're on a time crunch because of the cafe will close. But he couldn't leave Pikeville until a little bit later. Like this. But anyhow, I don't advise cutting cheese in the front. <laughs> we're stupid. Uh, uh. degrees out it's beautiful and Tony made it through the five o'clock traffic in Nashville like a boss it went smooth and we just followed our instructions and but we're about an hour from the cafe and we're gonna head there and eat and then we're we are staying back up in Traveler's Rest at the KOA campground up there so first stop Swamp Rabbit hey my watch thought I'm worked out <laughs> but uh, we'll see you at the cafe, see you at the cafe. What'd you get to eat? A turkey sandwich. <laughs> you are a turkey sandwich. We brought our food outside because, you know, it's a beautiful day and we haven't had that many. We haven't had any. <laughs> it's been winter, but I got the spring pagocha, which has kale and spinach and something else. I can't remember, like a third green, but it also has a cheese and I don't remember the cheese now. I think maybe a goat cheese. But it has a uh, cooked cabbage. It's really good. It's almost like a cabbage that's inside of a wonton. And Tony, there's Tony's turkey sandwich. How is it? It's really good. I didn't know what gluten-free bread would taste like, but is it good? It's not bad. Can't tell any difference. Oh, <laughs> I guess. I mean, that's a good thing if you can't tell any difference. It's no gluten. But mine's very good very very good so um, we're gonna eat this and then go into the store and do some shopping because there's a butcher inside that we want to get some stuff from to take back to the campground with us to be able to cook I thought the truck almost hit that person <laughs> but uh, we're gonna finish this and we'll go on inside I'm so excited about how excited are you about this butcher well it's pretty neat I mean, yeah. super cool super cool and I, I got good, uh... maple coffee sausages oh Go some okay, I want the powdered sugar. Well, we've made it to our campsite. We are staying. I'm going to have to say this already, but I'm saying it again. We're staying at the KOA Holiday in uh, Traveler's Rest. It's Traveler's Rest slash North Greenville. It was about 20 miles, well, it's 14 miles, 20 minutes from the Swamp Rabbit where we were at, so not far. We were nine minutes from a um, grocery store, so we stopped on our, on our way back from the Swamp Rabbit and got groceries. But uh, I'm so excited to, I'm so excited to cook tonight when we get ready to eat. I bought some meat from the butcher while we were there. And I bought some maple coffee sausages. They they make all their sausages right there. Is there something on my face? But um, we're set up. Tony is working. I'm going to have to work here in a little bit. I have some vacations I have to work on. But 
we have our bed made we have the groceries put away we have uh, coffee all ready to be made we have we're all hooked up and we're just going to chill tonight tomorrow it's supposed to be 60 and there's a nature trail that goes up on the mountain kind of around so i think we're going to take that but saying that i think we're going to sign off for the night unless you have something to say it's been a great day it has been a great day <laughs> see you in the morning good morning i'm gonna make us some breakfast from some of the things that we got at swamp rabbit yesterday i got some fresh irish bacon from the butcher so i'm gonna fry some of that up as you can see i got some in the pan irish bacon is actually called also back bacon because it's taken from the back of the pig and not the belly like we usually eat here in the states but i'm also going to fry up some eggs and we got some some cheddar scones when we were at the swamp wrap in their bakery so i'm going to cut those in half and reheat those and instead eat those instead of a biscuit we're going to do the cheddar scone so um, i'm looking forward to breakfast this morning i really wish you all could smell this bacon because it is smelling divine Ready to go on a little adventure? Let's do it. We're gonna take a hike on the nature trail that's actually here in the campground. How convenient is that? It's just right up this hill over here. And it's supposed to go all the way around the back to the back of the campground, way up in there. So uh, we'll see how it goes. I've already had an encounter with a snake this morning. So <laughs> I'm not starting my wildlife adventures off too well today. Yeah, I wish I'd brought some sunglasses. RVs, but Tony just made a point that if it was summer, we wouldn't be able to because all the leaves would be on the trees. All that walking I did is null and void because I had an ice cream. Not to mention I had all that bacon this morning. At least we got our heart pumping a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, that was good. But uh, I need some water. Tony drank all of our water, so I need to go back in. <laughs> Wait, Tony brought a water. I forgot to bring a water. <laughs> so I'm going to get some water. So it's lunchtime, and I've put together a little RV charcuterie for Tony and I. I did some... Uh, capicola I got from the butcher at Swamp Rabbit yesterday and did some brie and some smoked gouda and some provolone. Yum yum. So our after dinner treat tonight is just some bread that I have grilled up. I, we had a large loaf of it and I cut it in slices and added some butter and I've drizzled some of the honey on it that we got at the Swamp Rabbit Cafe. So it's, it's a nice local honey that um, I'm looking forward to eating. I, I love honey. So again, I just grilled some bread up and drizzled some honey. Easy peasy, but it's going to be delicious. 